Welcome to the channel. Wow, welcome to the channel. Oh, shut up. Right, hello. We have made it. We are in the rear block. And, um, um, let's pull it. Let's go. Yes, that's how you do it. Oh. Golden chip. This is quite a, a nice sunset tonight, actually. Uh, uh, the other side. Right, so I uh, thought we'd just come this way, and we'll just, yes, that's how to do it, it's rush hour, um, rush hour is no messing about, there's a care home over there, uh, there's lots of new houses here, it's all changed, when I used to come to college here, this lot, there's houses all built back there, uh, it's all different. Why am I coming up here? Because uh, I need to turn left at this roundabout. Uh, turn left here. And shuffle off to Buffalo Boo. Right. The buses. The bus is coming off because the bus stance is up here. This is the, um, what is this? I've been in that hotel in there. You can smell the food. So the bus will be going, turn left. What the hell? Oh, that's just no entry. So it's no entry for cars, but it is buses only. What it says. Cheers, all the electric car. Idiotic crap, clap trap. There's still there's people argue about this, still argue about it, and it's just so ridiculous. You know the electric car thing. Oh fuck off your Women's Day. That's bollocks. Women's Day, my arse. You're already privileged. You're already getting men to do everything for you, and you're gonna have a Women's Day. You know. I mean that is bollocks. Absolute bollocks. You could actually take your camper van in here, can you? Sleep in here would be the thing you could do. Guy sitting in his car, electric car, <laughs> laugh. There's another one, they're all sitting in their cars. I mean, how idiotic. Imagine if you said years ago, oh, you're gonna, when you fill up with diesel or petrol, you're gonna have to sit in your cars. You know? This is a pit stop. Had a pit stop. Uh, you know, it's so a bit ridiculous, isn't it? I mean, what? That'd be like me going to fill up this car and sitting around for an hour, trying to claim it's a good thing. That's what they do. They start kind of like lying, like saying, "Oh, you know, in the past there'd been the types that have been going absolutely mad about having to wait at a garage or something." 
But now it's, oh, nobody does 200 miles in a day, you know. It's like, they're just sort of like mansplaining themselves. They're not, they're not being honest with themselves to try and perpetuate this claptrap nonsense, you know, that prevails. It's prevailing because the government's pushing it on us. And then, and it's also the thing about once you make a decision, you've got to stand by it. So they'll never admit that they've made a mistake, you know, by buying an electric car. So that was the park and ride. What a laugh it was. I really did enjoy that. So now we're going up to see Neil Oliver, see if he's in. I still don't know where he lives. Actually, that's actually a really bad thing. Like, if I did know, I wouldn't actually show you. Because I actually quite like him. You know, and I wouldn't want to infringe on his, infringe on his privacy. You know, I actually think he's a decent guy. Yeah, so I'll shut up about that. I met a lady at a university and she lived over here on the left. And she wanted to go swimming, so we went swimming. And we went back to her house, she pulled a big sword out. A big fuck off sword. A big long sword. This is. I'm not making this up. And I thought. I'm not going to visit you anymore. Because I, I mentioned that I like Donald Trump. And that is really, like, if you mention that to some of these lot. But it's alright if they say they, you know, they can say who they don't like, but I'm not allowed to say who I like. You know, like, it's, it's all sort of one-sided. And there's a very definite sort of, um, it's almost like a book with, well it's not a book, but it's like a list of who you can like and who you can't. You're not allowed to like, you know, could have went up over by the castle. Uh, it might have been interesting. Uh, go up round that way, through. Uh, could have done, could have done it that way. The king's knots on the left. I mean, the Dumbarton Road is, well, that would be it there, probably, but, I mean, up here, if you, instead of going around this corner up here, you go straight on, that would take you down Dumbarton Road, which is, would be where you would come out. So they went away with our car parks and everything for bike lane. Is there anybody on the bike lane? No. Is there anybody on it? No. You know, I mean, it's, it's not going to change much. They put the price of cars up and price of this. It's, people are still going to use cars, you know. Um, so road ahead closed. The uh, Barton Road. I mean, you need a proper money. There's one of the houses for sale further back down there. Uh, semi detached. Uh, I can't remember how much it was. It's quite, uh, it's like 500,000 or something. Actually, it wasn't that expensive. Ah, you think 500,000 is not that expensive? Mm. There's money up here. Money. Yeah, definitely money up here. Um, right, which would you want to go? Ring Road, Comes Bar, Hospital. Could go that way for a change. Um, I tend to turn right, I think. Probably the more. Could turn left. Uh, I will just turn left for a change. Normally I'd go up that way. 
Um, so this this will take you down to this will take you down put near a police station probably. Uh, I can't remember. Yeah, and then I need to turn right to get to St. Ninians. Yeah. Out of traffic. So turning right. Fuck it out. <laughs> 30. Look at the assholes. Come on. Lights changed. Indicate. Indicating. This is probably a quicker way of doing it actually than going right. The way I was doing it was going right round like Tor Brex. I think it's called Tor Brex. We're going to get a copyright. Come on! Oh, there you go. Light lights on that thing. I thought that car was turning right, I don't know why. My great aunt lived on the left, right there. About there where the gap is. She's long gone. Long gone. Do you know what I mean? No, she was probably... Just 70 when I seen her in the, in the 70 when I in the, in the late 70s. So that's time just keeps flying past. And I hope you enjoyed that video. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Please remember to give me the next video. What's the point of this video? I don't fucking know. I don't care. Oh, there's this lady on the cross. Yep. Yeah, that's it. Go for it. Run. Run across the road. Oh, just take your time then. It'll be fine. We're off.